All right. So, bottom line, supplements help. Supplements are great, but you gotta do the work. And we're live. <laughs> Is that thing good? It's good. <laughs> pops when you're hungry. Yep. So we've determined that you talk too much. I talk too much on the videos, and guys. I'm not I'm serious sorry. enough. <laughs> Who's that? You're not serious. I'm not serious enough. What are we going to talk about today? I think supplements. You go first? No. <laughs> I suck at delicate. I'm like tough love. I just say it like it is. Mm -hmm. A very analytical, very educated, and very um, supplements. Supplements. Supplements are just that. Like vitamins. Supplements. Yeah. supplements. Extras. They're called extras. Right. If you want a little extra, you go get a supplement. If you want an extra vitamin D, you go get a supplement. You, if you want an extra vitamin B, you go get a supplement. You want the short version of supplements, what I think. Like I could name. Yeah, I need. Well, no, I just gave you the short version. Of the <laughs> um. I think it's extremely common for people to have ex their expectations of supplements are too high. What kind of supplements Sometimes. we talked about? Um, I mean, there's all kinds of different supplements. Are we? I, I'm anything? referring to all of them: creatine, pre-workouts, oh. fat burners, yeah. proteins. I, I've been approached before, man. Do you know what? Or, Kind of what kind of protein you use in or you, you'll see somebody else ask somebody big in the gym and it's not always about the protein there's nothing magical in the protein there's nothing magical in the fat burners there's creatine there's purpose, there yeah. there is a purpose and even the creatine has been scientifically proven to help but it's not going to do the work for you all right so bottom line supplements help Supplements are great, but you got to do the work. You've got to make a commitment and decide what your goal is. And if your goal, like for my goal, is to get, you now I want to get bigger. Oh, what did we say the other night? Hey, I'd lost like, I don't know, 20, 25 pounds over the course mm -hmm. of the last year. Now I'm gaining weight. Why? Because I'm gaining muscle, right. but I'm not gaining fat. Right. So the more I work out, the more I gain Hopefully, that's my goal is to gain weight, to gain muscle weight. And through hard work, training, and some assistance from supplements, which what creatine. do you, you use creatine regularly. Yeah, pre-workout. And pre-workout. Yeah, and I use both stimulant sometimes and non-stim when we have it. Mm -hmm. um, stimulant is caffeine. If it makes your heart race, it's right. like it causing, you can get a non-stimulant. Without getting like all super scientific, because right. I am not that, guys. I'm here to give you the gist, the basics. Wow. But there are pre-workouts that have different ingredients in them that help with mental wow. focus. Do what? I was cut my tongue. <laughs> <laughs> but they help with your mental focus. They help um, expand vascularity, which is... Uh, Additional blood flow, which allows for more blood to the muscles, which in turn helps muscle growth. There's, like a there's kick in the butt yeah, during your workout in the gym. Primarily, a pre workout is to give you energy and help you your mental focus in the gym. And quite frankly, if black coffee or a cup of coffee can, can work I'm virtually on. the same yeah, thing. Anything with a lot of caffeine. But the pre workout that I use, it has the pump inducers and different things in it. I like it. And again, like the fat burners, guys, fat burners, they work. They help, but it's not going to do the work for you. Nothing's going to work unless you do. Right. Nothing works unless you do. But, this, you know, I mean, you have anything? It's, I don't know. It's really hard because we all have goals. Mm -hmm. And sometimes our goals can be a little unrealistic for ourselves because we're going long term and, and big picture when we need to stay short term and in the moment goals overlap over time but and that's okay I, that's what I always tell people yeah, you need to have absolutely. short term okay. goals uh -huh. 
you know, set a goal by the end of the week that you want to lose one pound. Set a goal by the end of the month that you want to be able to bench 10 more pounds than you benched yeah. today or something. You know, you set short-term goals, long-term goals. If, if you want to lose weight, I've been there. I, you know, I don't want to succumb to my genetics. And I love you people. But we big people <laughs> in my family. Oh, and, I do too. And if you want to lose weight and your goal is to lose weight you've got to focus on that all the other things will come along there will be muscle growth there will be those kinds of things but it's not going to happen doing the same things over and over and over you do we have time to something. touch on something else really quick if there's anybody still watching this video <laughs> how do i don't even know how to put it but i kind of lost my train of thought too um, not doing not getting it by doing nothing <laughs> going I mean weight loss I, I totally yes that's what I wanted to talk about we have both been overweight mm -hmm. we're we are average people who go to the gym we try to live a healthy lifestyle most of the time we're, we're not perfect by any means mm -hmm. but we're just we're we, we we're speaking from experience we've done it I've been 255 pounds before in, in a size 38 pants back in 2004 and I've been as small as 150 in a size 32 because I thought skinny was cool so we're speaking from experience and you you've had three children you've had the weight on you have decided that you didn't want the weight there and you've right. done something about it but it's not easy no it's not it's easy. not easy and working out twice a week would not have produced the results that I have now we worked out sometimes seven days a week twice in a day we did sometimes. Oh. We did boot camp. Mm -hmm. We did our four days a week in the gym. Right. Resistance training, weight training, but and we that's did boot camps. Because I pushed myself. Not everybody has to do that. And there are some people who lose it quickly, and some people who it stays on, it stays on, it stays on. You get discouraged and then we give up. But this is, I've come to realize, and I love it because it works for me, but this is a lifestyle. This is a forever commitment. It's almost like a disease you were going to be stricken with for the rest of your life. You have <laughs> to commit to it. Right. Um, because just like with any supplement that is our up, latest up and coming trend of lose weight quick, fast, quick, lose weight fast, it's not sustainable. It doesn't last as soon as you go off of it. And it's every time, almost every single one of them. As soon as you stop, the weight comes back right. on sometimes twice. Now, through that period, we're, we're referring to a period where there was about four months there, I think. We both lost about 20 pounds. And we were using fat burners, so we actually got some free because we bought some stuff. We had two or three bottles. Yeah. Didn't you didn't use it? Mm -hmm. I did. Yeah. That's right, because I took yours. So yep. correction. I <laughs> used them through that period. But again, we were working out five, six, seven days a week, sometimes twice a day. Yeah. And really stringent on what we were eating. Yes. We really closely following what we were eating. eating. And I, I did use the fat burners through that period I used my bottle and yours but I still sustained the lifestyle I didn't just lose the weight and quit I don't use the fat burners anymore I haven't had a fat burner and I don't know how long but I'm, I'm maintaining and I'm not really trying to lose any fat or weight right now I'm actually trying to get stronger winter's coming anyway so it won't hurt if I put on a little extra weight and that's the bottom line is it get bigger you have to eat more mm -hmm. so yeah but and I guess the, the end of the day it's supplements are just that they are supplements to they're not meant to do all the work they're right? not meant to do all the work but guys. they do help they some do. of them do absolutely 